कृपया ध्यान दीजिए द लैंग्वेज यूज ऑन द पॉडकास्ट मे नॉट बी फिट फॉर कंजम्पन वी वॉन्ट यू ट्रेड केयरफुली बट लिसन यार डोंट बी सो कंजर्वेटिव Yes, what an ego to call the show after yourself. A uh, couple of politicians in India do the same thing, but uh, I don't want to get into names. Uh, this show is called Somebody Says, and today we have the pleasure of Oban Ronakon Jr. Uh, just a little background to Oban because my lovely young producer Sparsh, of course, uh, very keen to get him. Doesn't know that we actually have a strong association back in the day. We went to Saint Javier. स्मार्ट <laughs> 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 Next thing I know, I'm swimming on land. <laughs> and oh, these guys on are coming, land. Okay. And these guys are going, buck up, buck up, Shabash, come on, buck up, buck up. Four, damn, five guys are around you. He did all the swim. Yeah, I did, I did all that shit. Yeah. <laughs> so it was, it was humiliating a little yeah. bit, but it was more funny. And knowing, then, uh, knowing you, you would have enjoyed. Yeah. I sort of enjoyed your performance. Well, I didn't have a choice. You know, once you're in, you're in. You got to give it the best. It's like this podcast. You want to play opera. At last, Kala, but you didn't get that gig. This is what you got. You do it. Shavik yeah. Bakhti saying good to see Atul Khatri. <coughs> That's not Atul Khatri. Well, okay, let me tell you. You're talking to, a, and I'm not saying this because I'm half Catholic and I'm very communal. You're talking to an athlete, okay, mm. par excellence. He was one of the best athletes in Xavier. He's a <laughs> national champion, 110 meter hurdler. Uh, anybody in athletics fraternity would have heard the name Oban Ronakan Jr. Jr. is very important. That's Junior. something you yeah. tell us about later. Now, only, only so Atul yeah. Khatri, no, I just want to say, no, not anything against the Sindhis. But how many freaking athletes do you have? I mean, I mean, how many have you produced, man? I mean, how many champ? Narendra Irwani, one leg spinner I'd heard of, yeah. who had real trouble tying his shoelace. He had to call his knocker and say, "Hey, Raju, aja." Ha. Because bowling is coming. Ha. So, Oban, what the hell, Atul Khatri? We're a lovely guy. We all love Atul. Atul also runs the marathon. I know for a fact. Yeah, I don't say what <laughs> runs you're using no, loosely. This is Atul. Atul Khatri, the, the, the comedian. comedian. Yeah, he's yeah, a yeah. dude. Yeah. yeah, he's a great guy, but he's no, he's no Oban man. Yeah. If you and him started, <laughs> I'd, I'd race him. I'd race him. Race him. <laughs> You'd walk him. <laughs> yeah. He'd be like you and your Pomeranian who's eaten too much. You know. No, I can. Together. I can imagine Atul Khatri standing there and grumbling or something. Yeah. Yeah. This is wrong. Yeah. This thing. Yeah. How his daughter shamed him into doing this race and all. Yeah. 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 There'd be a story. But but Atul, you know we're not making fun of you. We just love you so much. It's whatever the right thing is to say. Blah blah blah. And moving on. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> give it up, Atul. Guys. To, yeah, give it up, Atul. Atul, 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 Atul. So this shameless Harami used to bully wow, people. Wow. Okay. But again, again, I'm saying, and I'm not saying we should rag. I For feel, those I in the chat before, wrong. before we yeah. call him, we should, <laughs> yeah. officially, we should officially wrong. introduce him. Yeah, we, we will, we will yeah. in a second. But I'm just saying, just let's clear the point here. Because I have this argument. I've had this argument when we shot MTVU across the country with, uh, in hostels. You know, a lot of good ragging also happens. Again, I'm not endorsing it, no, no, but it's, it's like wrong. <laughs> <laughs> You're ready for politics, bro. Why do you quit? Don't quit. Come back. I need to change my name. Here, but okay. I'm working on it. <laughs> Let, let's introduce you. Abbas has got the whole uh, Google thing ready. Oh, uh, not the whole Google thing. He's uh, the chief of business live events at Book My Show. I yeah. could never That's imagine it. <laughs> chief, bro. When you were chief. when you were lying drunk on your back, you know, one of the events, and you know, this is this is me conning a Sindhi. <laughs> <laughs> I can't ask you, James. I made myself wow. chief. Wow! Wow! Yeah, and he's been on the show also. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Can you imagine that? So, what is he called? Chief of business. Business. Uh, yes. What the fuck does that mean? See, none of your business. <laughs> <laughs> As long as he's a chief. Yeah, yeah. You're right. There's some of them are odd, na? CTO and CSO and all yeah, this. They start becoming a little scary for yeah. me. I wanted to be. I was. I, I was thinking of some new. Yeah. One. Yeah, CBO. What are you? I wanted to be chief of chief of awesome. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, about I'm not against weed per se, but if you have to smoke it, can you like you know wait for the show? Because if you, uh, here's my card, I'm chief of awesome. Yeah. Whoa, wow, that's cool. Awesome. Uh, and you can even spell it differently, like yeah. you know, awesome with the awesome, W's. Yeah. Just throw yeah. them a little bit. Or with the Z, awesome. Mm. You can tell them the W is silent or Z is silent. And Z is a new yeah, thing. Yeah. You put Z everywhere. Yeah. You think? Boys. Yeah. Zaf off. <laughs> I think my mom will buy it. Why? I didn't abuse. Yeah. yeah. Well, I've started abusing in front of everybody now. You know, I have to about stop. About time. Uh, I think yeah. so. But, but in Parsi general, when people are dying, uh-huh. to say, "What the fuck is going on here?" You know, what I mean, yeah, but that's right. that's more emotion. That's, no, not at all. I couldn't get parking. Abusing is <laughs> abusing is punctuation. Right? You think? Yeah, I think uh-huh. it makes it more. Real. Okay, but let's quickly get the journey then, now. Huh? So let's go back. Uh, Fountainhead. No, what is the first? 
Wait, yeah, wait. Fountain Air is where we start. No, we'll talk about athletics. We'll come back to that. Huh. I'll get fired by the great 22 year old <laughs> Bihari from Gurgaon who decides, hey, you don't do it. When, when you know the guest, you need to do your own talking and all that. Because he's done research. And no one gets. And the guest doesn't want to talk about himself also. He'll just talk like this for uh-huh. half an hour and then the guy. So I did, I did athletics to get into St. Xavier's College. Yeah. yeah. As simple as. And that. your name is Owen Ronikin. Yeah. In those days, you used to walk in. First is Ronkin, not Ronikin. Ronikin. Yeah. Crucif- Crucif- I did one Ronkin, Ronkin, Ronkin. Ronkin. Oh, and I was the cross. It was, it was, and, and, and I'd given myself a rhyme also. You want to hear it? Sure. Owen Ronkin always. <laughs> Why is it oh, I lost the audio for a second, <laughs> yeah. Who beat that part out, man? Who <laughs> beat that part? Rishi is from Panvel. He couldn't figure it out. What is it? What is it? <laughs> Owen Ronkin always. Again, he beeped it, bro. What the hell? <laughs> one minute, I, I didn't pick it up. Okay. <laughs> But weren't you already a champion and all that? No, no, there so was athletics quota and all that, that nonsense. Was, no, no, I was. I got in for, I think it was athletic quota. Uh-huh. But, uh, I, into schools, I needed to get in. I needed some certificates. So I went in, into into schools. And I mean, I, I did uh, my, that sports day thingy yeah, in school. Hmm. In the 10th standard. And then I won some stuff. You're telling Abbas about sports day? <laughs> huh. Sport. How dare you? No, no, I, he, he looked I, confused. So I just uh, said, <laughs> short foot. You hurt yeah. him. He, uh, he doesn't mind the Muslim bashing. He gets really angry with the fat shaming. Sport, right? Be very careful. Uh, yeah. Bronze medal in short foot. There you go. Yeah. There you go. Do look. Big guys always ask. Do look. He came third. third. <laughs> you explain the match. He, he just showed up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. He said, but we'll give you third, not second. <laughs> because he was late. Yeah. You were late. No? The PT master is this way. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they have to teach him, huh? Uh, in the yeah. final, sir. Aisa pakar, huh? <laughs> and don't throw on the coach. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wow. Owen didn't know five minutes ago I existed. Now he's roasting me. Okay, all right. <laughs> Sorry about it. Owen is like, he's like a, like a pack of wolves. He's one of those guys. He just right. joins in. I can totally see the ragging yeah. bit now. <laughs> <laughs> on the streets of Bandar, somebody's robbing an old lady and you just come and oh, let, let me also join you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'll just take the bag. I'll hold the bag here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so, athletics Hoda then? Uh, so, then Xavier's happened. Uh... Xavier was pretty good actually. So I was one of the few athletes in Xavier. Yeah. Uh, won a couple of. Yeah, I was about to say Xavier's. I have known more for its artistic endeavors than. Huh. So we've had, we've always but had was, the odd sports. It's, not, it's not been zero. Right. Yeah. We've always had. Yeah. Yeah. I, I was doing hurdles and was. Hockey, very artsy. hurdles, basketball, or, I mean, athletics. Yeah. All, we yeah. had somebody. Basketball were all the Nagbada boys. <laughs> it doesn't matter, no? We had some. that RF who was. He was the shortest guy who was in the. Abbas is very touchy. Uh, from Baikla, but. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Arif, so this, this is another amazing thing. The stereotype is always wrong, no? Yeah. The short guy being good at basketball. Yeah, he was the shortest guy. Okay. And he was the best at basketball. He could right? jump. He like this one. Yeah. yeah. He could just jump like 160 yeah. feet. Uh, yeah. and, he, and he was slightly scary also. He said, hey, yeah. block mankarna. <laughs> That's you the only English he spoke. Huh? <laughs> yeah. Block <Yeah>. mankarna. <laughs> now he's a call uh, center operator and he says the same thing. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> if Arif is watching this, we apologize. Sorry, they might. Arif. They're all friends. Old friends if they find sorry, out that Owen's on, you know. Yeah, yeah. I have to say sorry. Damien Owen. <laughs> uh, yeah. uh, so, so then that happened. And uh, But let me just tell you, you were very, he was a very chill guy, Abbas, uh, back in Xavier's. He was one of the, I don't know what cool is anymore, but in those days, Owen was the guy you looked up to because he was always relaxed, calm, strange shirts. Mm. Sometimes very colored and whatever, sometimes <laughs> hats. The guy called Schubert, a friend of his, was a nine foot six. Yeah, so yeah. That guy was... No, Who wasn't yeah. good at well, basketball. He was not good at anything, but he was great fun. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He was he always, was always around. There. He was a bad but three, four of them uh, always together, you know. Right. Right. They were like the big, uh, the alphas of the, at least when I was in junior college. And I, you know, I can't see him in a corporate job. <laughs> he was like, he was like the, the guy who never grows up. You're hoping that this guy stays in college for 10 more years. Uh, Kevin Monkey did, if you remember that. Right? <laughs> Kevin, there was a guy called Kevin Monkey. He Monkey. Did. That was his surname. <laughs> well, it's, it's, it's difficult to explain. Yeah. Even Steve Irwin couldn't crack that code. Yeah. But yeah. yeah. So, Every college has those guys no, yeah. who don't leave. And you, need them. you, you need, need them. them. You need them. Atul Khatri, are you listening? Yeah. You know, the white haired guy who's <laughs> always there. First year yeah. junior college you to greet you. Yeah. You oh. need them. And I had I had this plan of. Uh, now you're really going to take off on me. No, please. But I had this plan of uh, joining the, the Air Force. Air <laughs> Force. Wow. Yeah. And, but I got I got recruited in the Pakistan Navy. Pakistan were lucked out. You got recruited in the Navy. I got recruited. One sec, one sec. Are one you nuts? Sec. You went to join the Air Force and you're yeah. in the Navy. I mean, they, this is bro, they told me you need what math. I mean, what are you saying? Because they thought, they, they, they said you need math. And I, math. Oh, yeah. Come on. Math is what, like. A math for, you know, flying. for flying. Yeah. yeah you need I wanted, okay. Yeah. And you need yeah. math apparently. I mean, like, come on. Yeah. It's, it's all Man. equations, brother. Like, not in the Kanpur Navy. Kanpur is Jaipur, Jaipur Kanpur, Kanpur is Jaipur. You've got no. Oh, where's the maths in there? Uh, you have to add the meters <laughs> oh. and divide even, the degrees even in the Navy, of cal- angles like, of calculus. Measure there. nautical miles or whatever yeah. in the Navy. Yeah. yeah. You know, but, the so they didn't take me either. You know. <laughs> okay. 
it's his story abas okay yeah. let him talk <laughs> and then so then that got over uh. and then i passed college flying <laughs> 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 uh, 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 yeah yeah, yeah. Uh. and i had a i had a friend in college and she was uh, very sweet and she would you know try to get me to study uh. shona ha uh, and she used to, she used to get me to study am i right <laughs> Beep, bro. Are you happily married now? But we all had girlfriends, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What are you gonna lie about? And she would be like, you know, study and stuff like that. And you know, and, and we used to like be neck and neck with the with the grades. Mm. And she, ah, you should have studied. I told you. And then I would get that five percent more for sports and all this. Cheater, <laughs> cheater, <laughs> Catholic, yeah, yeah, yeah. Catholic, yeah, yeah, yeah. Catholic, yeah, yeah, yeah. Catholic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh India, bro. Bro, bro I actually had yeah. some of those moments also. Uh, you know? Really? Like one one time we were in college, and this time I was not ragging. Mm. Mm. And uh, There was some ragging going on. Someone was fooling with someone, and I went and and I said, "Chal enough." And I went to pull that guy out, and that one one of the padres were walking, and he caught me and Jalal. Remember Jalal? Yeah. Ji, ha. So both of us got caught, and uh, as in he misunderstood that you were ragging, yeah. but, but you were trying to stop it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But then our IDs were taken and gone. Oh, no. This is yeah. before BJP, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Just what's <laughs> that? <laughs> <laughs> so then Jeanette Pinto's office. Uh-huh. So went to Jeanette Pinto's office next day, like ma'am, and I walked in first. And she's like, oh, oh imagine. One second. If you meet Jalal, you'll know why he walked in first. Yeah. Let's mm-hmm. <laughs> just say Owen is more presentable. Huh? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I walked in first, and um, Jeanette Pinto was like, uh, you know, and this disgrace. Did not. You didn't expect this of you, yeah. and blah blah. I said, yeah, ma'am. You know, and she, and then suddenly she threw in the Muslim card. You know, right. Like, uh, you know, you must not get influenced <laughs> by. I'm like, boss. I'm, <laughs> I'm taking this one. I said yes, ma'am. No. What to do now? You know, yes, ma'am. One. one second. Jeanette running UP. What's going on? <laughs> yeah, full on. Are you I, serious? I bought the card and ran out scot free. Jalal got the problem. Oh no. Are you serious? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a terrible story to tell, bro. <laughs> Happy. A boss. Yeah. Let's let's get away from this one. <laughs> yeah. Mm. yeah. But was it Jalal's fault? <laughs> it was always, of course. I was just the innocent bystander. There too. you go. There you no, go. no, but. Hey, he was a great guy. We, yeah. we used to have good fun together. So let, let's fast forward a little bit. Otherwise, the whole show won't end because fucking <laughs> Xavier's. Then, uh. then, so then that whole thing happened, and then uh, I had to get a job post college. Right. Um, the way you're I, telling Abbas is like there are options. <laughs> 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 like you know, only <laughs> me, man. Suddenly, 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 Hotel industry didn't have me. <laughs> I got into the airlines, to be honest. Really? Yeah. My first job was with British Airways. Wow. I worked with British Airways at the airport. I'm then... saying wow, like it's Liverpool or something, <laughs> yeah. but still, yeah. yeah. Free tickets, bro. Free tickets. Uh, right. Yeah. And then was I... you? You took the job? Yeah, I took the job. I worked with British Airways for about. Can you do the announcement? Years. No, no, I didn't do the. I was not flying. Then what the hell were you doing? I was on ground. I was like operation. That's right, because flying yeah. needs mats, yeah. and you don't do mats. I. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then I then I worked with them for two years, and I worked with Gulf Air for a couple of years. I took a switch, and then I got I got transferred to Dubai, and there I couldn't hack it, bro. So the question: Why did you come back? No, I couldn't hack it because I don't know. I had a problem with one of the seniors. Yeah, you don't yeah. like authorities or problem with guys? Yeah, I had yeah. a problem with one of the seniors. I, I, I was I was coming back on leave, and he told me, "Okay, you know, you can't leave the country." So I left the country. <laughs> And now, then he, then I got. What we told you, you can't be gay. <laughs> what would your, what would be your reaction? <laughs> <laughs> Going by your science, <laughs> Owen, take a shot. You know, you know, it's all yeah, good. You know. It's all good. Would it be Jalal? <laughs> <laughs> In that case, he was in Dubai, so I ran away. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, yeah. So okay. then, then I came back and. Uh, at that time, all the other airlines were kicking. I was trying to find a job again. All the you're talking about the jet airways and all the ah, boom, the all boom, that, 90s, that, 90s. Yeah, that full boom was yeah. happening. So lots of jobs are happening and all that. I finally got a break with, uh, with jet airways at that point. Yeah. But then the World Cup was on. This is '96. Yeah, the World Cup was on there, yeah. yeah. and the matches were all in the night. Yeah. So how to start a new job? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean logic. So I said after the World Cup. You know, <laughs> Wow. Yeah. <laughs> But in the during the World Cup, so they Cup, cu- cut you. <coughs> Never took this. No, took no, it. no, no, no. They, okay. they were still on. Uh-huh. But I said, I, you I, know, I've got commitment. Football World Cup. You're talking about '94. Okay. I will finish my. So World America, Cup. America timings. You're talking yeah. about Football World Cup. No, yeah, Football World Cup. '94. '94. The horrible time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it was all one o'clock in the morning. Yeah. All that But nonsense. Yeah. Post game, three yeah. thirty-four, you'll be yeah. sleeping. So yeah. then, so I said, I have prior commitments. Can't join. Blah blah blah. Got into a, but then all the Catholic boys were sitting and watching together. Right. And one of the Catholic, two of the Catholic boys was Neil Murray and Brian Tellis. Yeah. Wow. They also were ex-airline. So one of the half-time asked him, "What is this 
airline sales. Yeah. Mm. So we said, why? Mm. And they said, I'm, I said, I'm joining Jet Air. So he said, why don't you join Fountainhead? And I said, what is Fountainhead? It's a book by Ayn Rand. Yeah. So I said, what is that? And he said, we do events. I said, what is that? So he said, why don't you come to the office? I said, okay, office. So next day I went to the office. But they just started, right? Huh. And yeah. the office was... Uh, His house. Otis's mother's bedroom. <laughs> With the with the mothers asked to leave, it's yeah. nine o'clock. Right. <laughs> Go sit outside. And, and, uh, and the, and the meeting was on the terrace because there's no room in the yeah. bedroom. That's how you start. And then you know, obvious choice. I have to can't believe your luck. Yeah. Said, What jet? This is great. Let's get into. I'm working from somebody's mother's bedroom. This is a dream come I mean, true. Yeah, yeah. So then canned everything else, jumped into Fountainhead. Mm. We were a small little shop at that point, just little uh, one bedroom. Yeah. And doing our mess. Yes. I'm Such sure the, party, the, the money you were getting at Fountainhead was way less than what you were being way offered. Way less than understatement. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think they gave you money. <laughs> But you chose to hang out with your... Yeah, it was yeah. just, you know... But they grew very fast, huh? Yeah. Right, right, yeah. So what were you saying? The, they went out of the yeah. bedroom in three days. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> bedroom didn't last very long. Yeah. It was, well, but it was a great journey. Yeah. And then... Well, fast forward to 20 years later where I where we sold the company to Dentsu. And mm. it was it was a great thing. covid hit i was chilling in goa but what are you doing what about those mahindra blues and all Haan. that that was the fountain that was all fountain no so we oh. we kicked off the mahindra blues where yeah. we we uh, we started that festival we did the one tree music festival yeah we i think the someone commented road. that they remember the one tree here yeah uh, uh, the one tree music those fest. are vendors who haven't been paid <laughs> so i don't think to take that don't think that owen told me not to take that <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, there you tree. go. Himesh said, "I used to love yeah. One Tree concerts in Mumbai, Owen. Thanks for the wonderful memories." Oh, thank you, brother. She met her thank husband you. under One Tree. <laughs> <laughs> Can she return him? I it? actually <laughs> have. I have a friend who met at the festival. I'm sure they'll the be a few. And they like got married and stuff like that. They still attend the 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 blues Now, if, as well. Now, if yeah. they separate, yeah. that's when you come in <laughs> as liability. Yeah, yeah. Because your damn jazz. The no, but I, I've signed the document. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I said only on couple entry you get. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So yeah. then we actually did, did the, you know, so Nikhil uh, and we, we kicked off the Smanoff experience. Right. So we were doing electronic music for a couple of years yeah, yeah. and all that stuff. And then, then, when, then I, then I. It's clear you don't like working in the day. All your jobs start yeah, at yeah, 1 yeah. a.m. It's a yeah. night time. <laughs> <laughs> Unless there's a football world cup in North America. In which case, you, then, yeah, then yeah, it takes yeah. a 9 a.m. Yeah. 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 Qatar, yeah. Qatar, mess, Ravi. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so, yeah, then, so we did a lot of music, had a lot of fun. Uh, I remember our first. first concert live concert that we promoted was a spyro jaira concert and uh, that's when jaram and me decided to start orange juice as a separate brand okay, you're using all these names of us doesn't know who they are but jazz I'm... band spyro guy no, yeah, yeah 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 not so, yeah, no jaira me mentioned the middle whatever ah. jaira <laughs> so jaram jaram and me decided don't say jaram vg we are minorities oh. <laughs> <laughs> so jay and me <laughs> go back to jalal we were feeling more comfortable here <laughs> <laughs> so then we kicked off orange juice hmm. and uh, we did a high level lot of shit yeah ha huh? then we the first first concert we did was spyro jaira hmm. and we were like you know sponsor yeah oh nothing i think and you know we can't make a loss and so we were finally we did bombay concert and delhi concert so uh it was so just cut to cut by the time we finished like like the sales of delhi concert the concert was about to start we were 23000 rupees profit yeah Hmm. like what? which year is this this is like back in the day i know early remember. 2000s yeah yeah early yeah, yeah. 2000s man so 23 grand there would be like 23 yeah. grand 24 bro. grand but the story today, doesn't end there bad. 25 maybe acha <laughs> the story doesn't end uh, 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 sorry to interrupt uh, yeah. no 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 papa said it we get one guess a month here <laughs> control the volume to rally book kya na main jo press road dikhao press road dikhao i'll never forget it love <laughs> <laughs> so then the uh, um, So we're we're leaving, literally leaving for the concert. Yeah. Like, what do you think? Oh, good one. Yeah, we're yeah. good promoters, yeah. you know. Right? Yeah. And the the manager of the ITC hotel, which you were staying at, he was like a big Spyro Jara fan. Yeah. And da, 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 you must come for dinner. Invited the band for dinner. We're so happy. Like you know, whoa. whoa. We finish the concert, come back. The guys have dressed up and come back for dinner. And this guy's Gul here. <laughs> Means that manager left. Huh. So these guys sat and they ordered here, yeah. and they ordered and ordered and ordered. I oh, got the bill. The loss ho gaya. Yeah. So the hotel loss. I want names of those hogs. Who we ordered everything. And Jaram is looking at me and Kiki man is like don't order don't order anything. That is so we have eaten nothing. Jaram is drinking you. water. But if he invited you how can they charge you? He just wasn't there to say that he invited us. This is like how IBM charges me for the omelet here. Yeah. Unnecessary. <laughs> that that's 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 not good, yeah. yeah. IBM 
That coffee, the coffee you had, Wait, yeah. as, a, as an IBM you employee, I should clarify you've never been charged for a. a no, audit. not yet, Abbas. So, coming soon. <laughs> but it's coming. Yeah. The final settlement, <laughs> they'll cut it. <laughs> there, there's a thing called a ledger. Yeah. 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 Every ledger is not a dead actor. actor. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> uh, so, where were we? So, you're doing all these events. So then, yeah. So, then concerts. Yeah. Yeah. Then the concert things happen. And then we then we started the small of experience. We kicked off the one tree music first. Question: When did Priya Das happen? Huh. So, as in the it, it actually no 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 it was huh. in the concert things only. Huh. So um, I was asked to um, re, we, so we, because of the concert we were doing some fundraising yeah. So there was there's this thing called which was then called the Spastic Society of India which is now called Adapt. In okay, Bandra, okay. Uh, don't make any uh, comment. I, I was not going there to. Why no would you have moment to of frivolity? Yeah, yeah. Let's hold our pace here. As I, I was, a, I was, I was I did the holy month of anything. Ramzan. Can I get you to just show a straight face for one minute? I was asked if I was the head. Uh, I don't. I just don't. I'm not going to be party. Or, <laughs> I, I'm off. So anyway, I'm coming to that side. So, <laughs> spastic society. Yeah. Yes. Mm. So, so, adapt, adapt, yeah. Adapt. So, we were, we were asked to a fundraiser for them. Mm. When So, Neil and me went in, organized the whole thing. We decided, let's do all this fantastic multi multi genre yeah, yeah, concert yeah. at rang bhavan mai rang bhavan rang bhavan of course can you not rang, rang, rang bhavan for us that was our mecca yeah. yeah so rang bhavan and uh, it doesn't exist now right you yeah, it doesn't it doesn't they just they, leaves flying around you, yeah. Yeah. you, you, you can do you can do unplugged concerts but it, yeah. Yeah. you can practice you can rehearse there. Yeah. yeah that's what yeah. you can do yeah. so yeah. um we went there set it all up and i was told now you have to meet the trustee once it was all ready so okay. next morning i want to meet the trustee and the trustee was priya dad Wow. But I thought you lived close by or something. No no no. So I never knew of her existence because her brother huh. he's a famous guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh really? Wait, let me google. Let me google. Who is? And growing up in Bandra, you're damn scared of him, I say. Why? <laughs> Dude. <laughs> But why would he what would he do to you? <laughs> huh? Why would he hurt you while you're running on your 100 meter nationals or whatever? Yeah, never known. <laughs> and so so it was damn funny because huh. so then Priya Dad and then we started, we became really good friends. We did the next year's concert as well. And but for one year you didn't date her. No, no, no. One year we like hardly spoke also. Ah. You still sound scared no, out of your mind. I am. Yeah. Like, no, no. He's no. worried if Sanjay Dad listens to the program. Yeah. Now what's my next move? Why you, why you said my name? <laughs> <laughs> Then he'll ask me to come on the podcast. <laughs> oh, forget talk that truth. <laughs> <laughs> so then, then the next year happened, and again we were doing it, and then uh, then we became really. Hmm. good friends hmm. close friends so long romance bro. yeah long romance yeah, yeah. and no but the first year was no romance no but that's great because ah. you the seed of like you know yeah. like a hungry horny yeah. man who's chasing a girl yeah, every yeah, day yeah, and all yeah, like yeah. a sophisticated guy hey, so it's now it's it was over like, a very yeah. common noble pursuit yeah. of helping we went for dinner. society we yeah. went for dinner. yeah what a and, fraud yeah. you are <laughs> no, see, and the first time i i asked priya out in that time but that time we were still i was still in my struggling mode yeah, yeah. and so yeah. i said let's you know one go for a drink yeah Like very casual. Let's mm-hmm. have a drink. Yeah, we were. I said, and that time, remember, Olive had just opened. Olive That's was fancy. Olive, One Olive drink is fancy, set you back, bro. bro. <laughs> so I've taken out Olive. And, and you uh, know what I do? You're yeah. looking at the price on the. Yeah, yeah, of course. Oh, God. God. <laughs> I mean, vodka <laughs> romance. Oh, and vodka romance. The romance of a cocktail. You can't focus on the girl because you're worried. There's like three or four untouchable moments. You eat. I just. Yeah. So. She ordered a drink, and I ordered a drink, and then you know, casual chat. And then she, after that, she said, "You know, this place is not happening. Let's go somewhere else." Yeah. Hmm. So I'm like, "Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now where to go? You know, this is not <laughs> yeah. happening. Me, the budget might yeah. be more expensive." Yeah, yeah, yeah. I said, "Now, I said, yeah. Even I don't like it too much. Yeah. You know, so let's go somewhere else." Yeah. So she said, "I said, where'd you like to go?" She said, well, "You know, this is this. There was a chicken rotisserie thing, thing. So on the road. Ah, uh, so let's pick up the chicken and we sit in cart road and chat." Yeah. Wow, dream girl! I'd have married her myself. Said, Boss, then <laughs> yeah. sign, seal, yeah. deliver. Olive, one round is enough. Yeah. No second round, you punch gaya. Yeah, yeah. Sign, seal, deliver. Would have lasted, deliver. huh? Can you imagine? You'd be calling Neil for money or something yeah. from the corner. No, yeah, really. Yeah. And that time, no credit cards, and you couldn't yeah. do GP. And, you say trusty, trusty. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Worth the investment. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Then, uh, so that happened, and then, um, so that was a that was a fun one. And um, then I told, then I decided to tell my friends that you know I'm dating people. celebrity. Yeah. Yeah, so I said first Priya, and then I when I said the surname, they took out their phones and deleted my number. <laughs> like, you apna sambal, bhai. Really? Yeah, yeah, they deleted my number. I can't believe this. Yeah, the BJP was already making inroads. Yeah, they just said <laughs> doubt. <laughs> Now this is not a BJP. This is SD. Yeah. Oh right. SD is yeah. K. Yeah. 
So SD was very scary. Hmm. He was a member of parliament at that point. Yeah? No, no, I'm talking about junior SD. Oh, senior SD is very yeah. SD so was did, a member of parliament. Did senior SD approve? Senior SD was, I tell you honestly, the probably the finest human being I ever met in my life. Yeah. Absolutely. Besides you. <laughs> <laughs> that's the obvious. Sir. Sweetie. Hi. That's the obvious. Sweetie, Hi. let's Hi. go to Hi. Olive. Hi. Come on. Uh, I'll just have soda. No, no, no. <laughs> you go and bring the chicken into Olive. I know you. <laughs> so, yeah. so, yes. The finest gentleman I've ever met. Yeah. I mean, I've they broke the mold for sure. Yeah. What a man. Yeah. What a man. And I was privileged to so, just so have So, the fear coming back was uh, the, the son, the brother. Yeah, the brother was yeah. Yeah, he's scary. He was possessive <laughs> of the sisters and that kind yeah, of thing. Yeah, he was like, oh, you need to get married. <laughs> <laughs> You're quoting. <laughs> Literally. Why? Why? Uh, uh, <laughs> There's problems being sorted. Okay? Uh, <laughs> Don't get married. Uh, I said, okay. To you? Yeah, and then I, I went to seek permission and then... Uh, oh, said the mafia, man. Yeah, he punched the wall. Yeah. <laughs> That's his response. And the wall shook. <laughs> It shook. He punched the wall. Yeah, and it shook. So he was happy, I guess. <laughs> no, he was like, "Acha, no, no. we'll get see what it. I can do." <laughs> and it just shook a little bit. It went. Wow. Said, okay. Did you uh, tell Priya don't complain to your family ever, please? <laughs> yeah, I've never given. I've never given a reason to. <laughs> I just says before she says she says no, say hi yes. to me. I say sorry. Yeah, <laughs> super. It was my fault. Yeah. I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> we had a comment by Shadab. I think he did a super chat. Uh, he's paid us six Canadian dollars, Cyrus. Oh, he says, wow. he guess how much gold the Dutt family gave to when his dowry, which is a, ah! which, is a <laughs> which is a dialogue from. Good one, good one. <laughs> good one, good one. Yeah. Now, honestly, yeah. Uh, we are against dowry, but in case they were to give you uh, something, what would you have liked? Just love and respect. Uh-huh. <laughs> Yeah, and and six, six Canadian dollars. <laughs> 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 you, yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm taking a screenshot and showing them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, no, I'll not. <laughs> it's okay. It's a happy, it's a happy world at the moment. Problems are not uh, internal, the external. Uh, we have a, I, I, I swear, it's a great family. We have yeah. fabulous vibes. It yeah. was, we just. I mean, it's just a great family. Okay, let's segue away. Your romance bores me. Ah. Let's go away from it for a minute and get back to the most beautiful part of your life story, which is your corporate uh, succession. Yeah, so now I'm in a, I'm very corporate, you know. me. I'm. In a... No, so then the huh. founder gets Sorry, sold. I, I, don't know I, what you say. I, I have a question. So huh. You said you were chilling in Goa when the pandemic hit. Yeah, so, pandemic. so as, as someone who was in charge of live events, suddenly everything goes. Yeah, uh, so that was up. seriously How scary. Yeah. So, see, see, you so, were alone in Goa? As in. You know, fam- so up and down, Priya no, was with me. Fam- Where was the family? So Priya was with me most the of the time. Kids? But, so the boys, halfway through pandemic, I put them into boarding. Mm. Yeah. So, so uh, when the pandemic started, they were in Bombay? You they were in Bombay. Bombay. So we were all in Bombay, so lockdown, shutdown. Yeah. yeah. So you know, the first month was like a little exciting. Yeah. Oh, so much fun. And the second <laughs> second month was like, oh, where we get potatoes and there's tomatoes somewhere. Third, you know, third you know, month, that- in my area, the people were asking, can we swap? Yeah. And all. It was the same family, same yeah. vibes. It was too much. Yeah, but third month, yeah. you were like, yeah, you yeah. couldn't do that because of love and respect. Yeah. 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 Okay. There's too much of that. Lovely guy. So, yeah. <laughs> so but, but it, I tell you, I shouldn't be saying this. Say it, say it. You already that, said that building of ours, we got locked down. Hmm. We had such a good time. <laughs> <laughs> While the world suffered. It was, it was, While the migrants tried to we, find their way, like we got to know each other. I mean, old people I were made dying. Some friends, it was, but kids were crying. You know, like, like, but you had a you great not, time. No, I'm just. <laughs> no, 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 no. As in, you know, made While the you were best swapping wives. But actually, yeah. this is but not actually Abbas, wives. we all discussed this. Yeah. Like, you made the most of what you had. Yeah. We were playing badminton like Jitendra and that exactly. bad song. Exactly. I mean, you know, in our lane yeah. with the wind blowing. What do you do? Suddenly you do there was do? nothing yeah. and yeah. everyone was happy with nothing. People were nicer in a way. Yeah. The community spirit came out. I've, I've, I made some friends in the pandemic. Which you never speak to after. I, no, no. And they're like so close. We've we gone on holidays together. You know, oh. I mean. It's really, I mean, men and really women together, same house. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, open. speak English. Also. a team here, Cyrus. No, it's still a, <laughs> he's a hurdles champion. You put the hurdle, he jumps over it, bro. This is a champion from childhood. <laughs> uh, but, so, yeah, sorry. So then I, I was like getting puck out, just take off to Goa anytime. Hmm. You know, I used to go drive down and sit there for some time. I mean, first time I drove, it was damn scary. It was like that, you know, on the expressway, empty, nobody. Mm. Yeah. I actually saw it's that a ghost ball. movie. Yeah, yeah, I saw that ball of, you know, thing that could, in the movie. Yeah, 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 yeah. The ball I saw. Bro. <laughs> yeah. And oh, they want dog. Westerns. And, yeah. That was Falcon yeah, Park. I, mean. I think she was. <laughs> oh my God, I didn't need to say that. Unnecessary. Sorry, Falcon. I love you. I mean, life. I do life with the girl. She's lovely. I always imagine Sparsh cutting off another name from the list of guests. I really like that. I apologize immediately. I can't apologize. I said sorry. Yeah. Abbas, it was your idea. Of course. Yeah, blame it on you. Beat you the dandestic. 
I got my own. अच्छा ओके हाँ so then chilling in driving Goa. driving हाँ uh, driving but you has to uh. be take off and sit and go off for some time. But Goa was a little lighter, right? Much better than what we had. Yeah yeah. yeah. And and you know where we stay, uh, we have our little house in Goa, which is very isolated. Mm. So it's really nice. In any case, it's isolated. Yeah. Plus, plus isolated, comes isolated. Yeah wow. So it was lovely. Then chilling out is where I met. I mean, uh, I was hanging with Ashish also. Oh. He was also chilling. Ashish is the boss of um, Book My yeah, Show. Yeah, he's okay. the founder yeah. of yeah. Book My mm. Show. Who got the got a dream in Africa when he was trying to watch True. elephants mating or something. <laughs> yeah. And had this so what if what if I bought I sold tickets for this? Yeah. Yeah. I, no, he would. I'd buy tickets for this. <laughs> so let me sell tickets. He also <laughs> offers uh, discounts, and then when you call him up, he doesn't take the phone. <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah. <laughs> You're the business head. <laughs> he, he makes me buy my tickets. <laughs> Set an example. What? Uh, he, Ashish thinking next pandemic we should make pandemic an event. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Brought to you by Pan Parag Pan Masala. <laughs> Spit no more. Yeah. <laughs> yeah or, 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 or carry on. Or gone, Ain't know. nobody around. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll call it graffiti. <laughs> So then, uh, sitting in Goa, then you know, started chatting with him. He was also, he had experimented with the live. And now, so Ash, Ash and me go back a long time when mm. he started his. Uh, was he in events? No, no, he was when he started his old ticketing. Mm. He literally experimented on me. What every, does that mean? That sounds every, sexual. As in, as in, no, no, he wishes. <laughs> <laughs> Ashish, only <horny> dog. <laughs> so uh, every time he kind of uh, you know came up with some new tech or some new stuff. Back in the day, you had to print oh, out and okay. come and stand with yeah, those. Yeah, yeah. So everything, little little advancement he did in his tech and little new ideas he came up with, he plugged into my show. And you know, I guess our show was also small enough for him to experiment on. So became good friends, thick friends. You know, built the journey together, kind of thing. Fell at the same times, got up at the same times, kind of thing. So we're chatting about the live music business in Goa, and then he popped the question as to why if I can come on as consultant. So I started consulting with the book my show for some time. Uh, this was around. I have a question because huh. I hate to interrupt your flow, but the thing is that what the hell does consultant mean? People bring up this consultant exactly. All, it's very. Uh, it's almost like I want to help you in life or something. I'll give you this job. Exactly right because you see, see, so guys are consultant. And what the hell do they actually do? So that's yes, so consultant. What does he do? But that's exactly what happened to me. So okay. I started. I started consulting. Now, what does a consultant do? You have to consult someone. I have to say this is a problem. So yeah. we say, you know, maybe this can be fixed. Ek minute, then middle class background. So troubleshooter. No, no. So that is. No, the troubleshooter is a different job. Yeah, this is trouble identifier. No, you, as in they put all the shit yeah, on yeah, your head. Right? Consultant is like you're doing this wrong. Bro. Figure it you, out. You figure yeah, out the that's solution. That's a great job, yeah, boss. That's a great job. You're the critic. Yeah. I want this job. <laughs> hey, spurs, go to the corner. Yeah, this is not happening. <laughs> <laughs> I can do this. Yeah. So that it started Very like that. Fascist job. But then when you are like you like middle class background kicks in, then you're screwed because then really? you say this is a problem. Ek minute, I'll make it. Yeah. Then you start fixing it. Yeah. You know. So then you or, or rather try and fix it. Huh. And then mm. before you know it, so I, uh, initially the deal was like I'll come in. Once in ten days, and you know, chat about this. Yeah. <laughs> Why work harder? And then, <laughs> and then he used to look at me like, again, you're here. Again, you're yeah. going. Yeah. Yeah. And then, so then, then he told me, listen, you're you're just sitting here all the time. You might have just joined, book my show. Yeah. So I think so, which is what happened. It's been it's been fab. I mean, I, it's it's, it's grown really big, right? I'm from, getting from to do what you mentioned I'm, when they yeah. come and experiment on your events in yeah. say uh, Mumbai or whatever, insane. and then suddenly it's insane. like insane. Insane. cross yeah. beyond India, you know, Look, literally. Rick and Ash, uh, Rick is the co-founder. Right. Ashish, he's like the silent quiet guy. It sounds like back. a sitcom about two gay men who love each other in you know war torn Syria. Or something, they actually, they actually love each other. I'm but sure they do. <laughs> <laughs> but, but he he's like the machine behind the Rick. Rick. Yeah. That's Rick without the P, huh? So don't make jokes. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Karan said he says so. Owen Ronkin was like the wolf from Pulp Fiction. Like you have a problem, you Ooh, call this guy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Harvey hey, I like that. Harvey yeah. Keitel. Harvey Keitel. Yeah. Karan, keep, like Harvey Keitel. Karan, keep in touch, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. <laughs> the wolf. The wolf. Okay, by the way, wolf. We have to take a break because uh, we have a maybe have a sponsor from next year. So we'll just stay where you are, and we'll come back in a second. Uh, Sora Padvi says, "See for Cyrus, critics, consultant, and chut." <laughs> Well, there's more bad words. Sir, you also stay in touch. <laughs> and it's pronounced suit. <laughs> yeah, he spelled it weirdly, but yeah, we can go into a bit. <laughs> okay, our podcast has gone premium. It's called Club. Cyrus says you can be a member. Join now. Don't waste any more time. In fact, don't listen to me. Just go and join. You'll get exclusive tidbits, uh, features, insights, all kinds of stuff that nobody else will get. It'll be just for you. Join now. Become a member of Club. Cyrus says. Ji ha. Hey, it's been another great week on the IBM Podcast Network.
Listeners, presenting to you Club Cyrus Says, the premium tier offering for our podcast. Club members will get exclusive Cock and Bull episodes every Monday, extended and unfiltered versions of the guest episodes, access to the Club Cyrus Says Discord server, and audio offerings such as ad-free episodes and early access to guest episodes. Also, members get to decide the topics of the live episodes and get their name on the producer's slate at the end credits. On completion of 300 episodes, that's 300 episodes, Simplify team revisits the time when they kick-started the podcast. They also hosted Amit Verma of the Seen and the Unseen fame, who joined in on this fun conversation. On Storytellers and Story Sellers, Vineet talks to Shirley DeCosta and Manoti Jain of Supari Studios. They discuss what it takes to create engaging content that blends content with strategy, creativity and technology. And on the Payments Ecosystem podcast, Sheila Ditya is in conversation with Sagar Agarwal and Aditi Oleman, the Senior Director of Product Management and Director of New Initiatives respectively. They discuss the growth of the fintech industry and the importance of collaboration in this field. Once again, don't forget to visit our merch store on the IBM Podcast website. We have some exciting stuff for you. Follow us on social media. We are IBM Podcasts on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram and LinkedIn. If you like our shows, spread the word. Tell all your family and friends and don't forget to rate and review our shows wherever you're listening to them. You'll also find all our shows on youtube.com slash IBM Podcasts. And finally, we would like to thank our sponsors this week, LIC India, Yono SBI, Cash Free Payments and HDFC Mutual Fund. Thank you for making this possible. And we're back. Oh, we're back. Yes. Sponsors, bro. <laughs> no, no, not for our show, for the other show. Okay. They're we promoting. Are, we are like the VO for the other show. That's, that's our show, basically. But offline, we were just discussing that your son spent... <laughs> <laughs> you said, please, I want to promote <laughs> my son. <laughs> oh, you said, talk about my son, man. Son uh, sent you to the MC Stand concert. That MC Stand no, no, concert. Yeah. And my, then son, my son loves various types of music. <laughs> oh. he, he loves it and... So he went crazy at the MC Stand concert. That's great. But Did you enjoy the first night, little later in the year, <laughs> he stood outside Shah Rukh Khan's manat for the whole night. Why? He's, he does stuff, man. I don't know. We His all uncle love Shah Rukh, is Sanjay Dutt and he gives Shah Rukh this much bhao. Wouldn't that cause trouble? <laughs> Sorry, Sanj. Huh? <laughs> I'd stand outside Sanjay Dutt's no, house, no. but I couldn't find it. So, it was in the main direction. I, ha- I have two boys and they're... Uh, Why was he outside Shah Rukh's house? Because he thought Shah Rukh comes and occasionally waves at people. But he's born into a Bollywood family. What does he need to do that? They don't behave like boys from Gurgaon who come here for the first time. (laughs) (laughs) Shah Rukh's house. He has has this bunch of friends. They're in school together. Okay. And uh, they They wanted to go. They're they're a big group of boys. And um, some of them had come to Bombay for the first time. Hmm. So they all, five of them jumped into a rickshaw, which is wrong in any case. So Why were they in a rickshaw? What are the boys called? Arijit Singh? I, I think he's yeah. some. <laughs> so that, guy, that guy is starstruck. From what I gather, huh? So they all went, stood outside Shah Rukh's mm. house. Then oh. they went, stood outside Salman's house. Oh. And then they've gone and seen they beatboxing on the street. And then they've come over. So Indian and youth MC Stan is in safe hands. Yeah. Yeah. MC Stan like is his uh, yeah. idol. Yeah. You know. it's a, what it's part a, of him is Catholic? <laughs> I'm working on it. I was about to say that sounds like a typical Bandra night out. Yeah, <laughs> yeah but you know, yeah. what happened to Liverpool and Man United? And all yeah, he's a Man U fan and I'm a City fan. Can you hammered imagine? yesterday, by the way, no? Yeah, yeah. Man U. As usual. Lost again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, we're digressing. Uh, we've got to take topics. This is also called Cock and Bull. Anything you want to say about your wonderful book, myshow.com? So, uh, anything coming in the future? Any great. Uh, so, great stuff. Our next big one is uh, Backstreet Boys. Oh, you yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah oh, you didn't know this? Oh, uh, the early bird tickets are already gone. No, no, the full Bomb- Bombay concert is oh, sold damn. out. Oh, I thought that's like <laughs> a Delhi euphemism for the Congress coming to power. <laughs> <laughs> no, it isn't. Why am I laughing? <laughs> <laughs> hey, you might plunge in politics 2024. Uh, no. I'd vote for no. you. I'd vote Abbas, for me too. Yeah, sure. That's three. Plus the Bhojpuri boy in the rickshaw. <laughs> yes, four. four. <laughs> We're doing okay. Salman, Sarukh, six. Oh, yeah. You give me Sanjay, four. that's seven. <laughs> Should four. have enough, yeah. Uh, Jalal, eight. For sure, Jalal. <laughs> <laughs> Jalal remembers to vote. He's that guy. Yeah. Uh, no, he's Jinnet Pinto, be. maybe not. Huh? No, no, no. <laughs> yeah. no so, um, yeah. Uh, Book My Show is great. I've been doing a lot of concerts. It's, uh, it's now. So, we're really betting on the whole live music Backstreet. business here. Uh, Sheet voice is insane. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that's what be... about what about national flavor? I feel it's very uh, international. Your your uh, thing. No, no, we have as a Desi, really as yeah. a Desi, as a Desh Bhakt. I feel that you know where it's no, like Falguni, see, for example. Yeah. Falguni in the plans. Backlane plan, huh? Backlane boys. 
छोटा गली गली के पीछे वो गली के पीछे और राइट बिकॉज हॉस्पिटल बिल्कुल कॉम्प्लिकेटेड टू व्हेन दिस सो सो वी हैव मेनी या साइड्स टू इट आई मीन देयर इज वन व्हिच द होल इलेक्ट्रॉनिक म्यूजिक साइड व्हिच वी which uh, which abbas loves no which so the sunburn pack is also with rock us. guy yeah, yeah. you don't like i only hear you listening to electronics not really oh electronics yeah, yeah, right he looks like that no 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 yeah. Yeah. <laughs> electronics sounds like you listening to a showroom yeah, yeah. <laughs> electronics so, uh, <laughs> yeah. so so that there's one piece and we do a massive indie are you piece. a good boss owen You are a great guy i'll say that I, but but then you make a great guy into I a boss a, I think you're I one of the lad guys boss. yeah i but think how, I, i can't see you being hostile to anyone and all that i can you be I think yeah he's a great like <laughs> yeah. as one of the guys yeah, yeah. Sure? no i think uh, i i think uh, some of some of sometimes they get a little confused they, exactly what are you saying you're so friendly and familiar then suddenly how can you be aggressive uh-huh. you know what i'm saying no so i don't think i get aggressive at any point but um, you put your finger in their ass there is a line where uh, which we shouldn't cross yeah thing, yeah. yeah sometimes i get ticked off and i get into that's why one back street boy left yeah <laughs> <laughs> Uh, okay, before we move on, uh, we have to address this. Iris, you put up a post on your Instagram I didn't, with you uh, and wi- your wife hanging out with huh. Seema Taparia. I don't operate anything. The famous Indian matchmaker. So what's Ooh. that about? Seema Taparia. Yeah, she's the world famous Indian matchmaker. World number one. She has a one. show on Netflix called Indian Matchmaker. Season three, yeah. as she reminded yeah. us, yeah. is coming out on Season April twenty first. Yeah. Where she's wow. matchmaking Indians in London. Yeah, yeah, oh. yeah. Mostly, none of them actually get married, but huh. uh, for the sake of the show, actually, some of them do. No, the the count we did, did the my daughter is a fan. Yeah. So we've done the head count, and it's like less than twenty percent. So you like think they're going to be happy ever show. after, and then they don't get married, or they're about okay. to get married. So she's doing a good job, or she's not. She became a sensation in urban India and in urban NRI market because she's exposed the whole arranged marriage setup. Yeah, yeah. And so she's very strange paradox. This retro woman with retro views, very chauvinistic in some. It is, it is, and then at the same time she's nice and charming and warm. Huh. So it's a real, you know, conflict like wow. that. So like me first, yeah, yeah I'm exactly. Very charming like, and warm, and I yeah, can she even dresses. Conflicted. She dresses like you. Show yeah, me. Like <laughs> <laughs> so, so, so but what her, was when? Ha, so some event, and I met her, and I went up to her because me and the wife are big fans, and you know my daughter Maya. Yeah. This is what she likes. What yeah, can yeah, do? Yeah, yeah. You know, I was oh, hoping. Maya must be a big girl. <laughs> yeah. yeah, she's five eight. No, <laughs> she looks like somebody else now. <laughs> <laughs> first few years of marriage, I was never home, so I don't know. You know. Yeah. But yeah, so so we only spoke to her, and I went and you know I did the whole thing about yeah. expecting her to say at least one thing back to me. I was like, Seema, I'm big fan. Yeah. Of course, doesn't speak too much English, so switched yeah. to Hindi, and I was already upset her. And then after that, she turns and tells the guy next door, "Who is it?" Then that guy said, "Who television? Who empty the bucket? Who is it?" I could hear everything. Yeah. Yeah. And then so she turned tell, tells me. I don't watch television <laughs> in a very dismissive fashion. Yeah, okay. so oh, my okay. wife loved her even more. Huh. You got lack of respect to me, <laughs> to my tribe, to all has so been. Everything that you've ever achieved in yeah, life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But but she's a huge sensation. Apparently her rates have gone through the roof. Really? So you're charging ten bucks for a thing huh. consultation. It's like a hundred bucks. It's like ridiculous. So she's wow. like creme de la creme. Yeah, it's true. So it's she a hit out like she can hit you up. You got to watch the show. It's entertaining. I swear to God, it's really entertaining. So yeah. she's like like a human version of Bumble. She takes them to astrologers, uh, kind of, yeah. And then they, then they follow up with the the whole Manglik thing and all, which uh, Sparshes. They do all that. <laughs> you go and marry a tree in the middle. Sparshes Manglik. Sparshes Manglik. Yeah. yeah. He carries his tree with him. <laughs> <laughs> he ties that. Yeah. And again, I would just like to reiterate my question hasn't been answered. That if you are a Manglik and you marry a tree, do you have to consummate the marriage? No, the tree has to. Yeah, be... yeah, but sometimes there are owls in this. Yeah. But, but <laughs> Owen, what you've not answered is this the Indian version of a threesome? Oh, good one. Check, that was a good check, one. Check, that was a good one. <laughs> that was a good one. Rishi is giving the approval. Yeah, yeah, another good man united I... lost. <laughs> Very happy man. That's all. We shall use this in the edit. <laughs> Uh, since yeah. this is a cock and bull, shall we do at least two topics before we? But go don't to ask us like it's democratic yeah. thing. He doesn't care. I don't care. So let's talk. Yeah, let's yeah. let's be switched yeah. to. Uh, let's switch about people we know. Yeah. Now. Is there someone we can make fun of yeah. and just bring them down? Uh, face slice bread is really the best thing. Ever. Vladimir Putin. I, I can't eat bread. Diabetic. <laughs> yeah, so it's not. <laughs> I just uh, yeah. General topic is yeah. sliced bre- bread the best thing ever. Uh, whole. Because they say best thing since sliced bread. <laughs> Why? Sliced bread, Multigrain. Yeah. Multi. That and since the invention of the wheel, Haan. best invention. I feel the yeah. bread is overrated. For me, the AC is the number one thing. Living in India, yeah, no. Yeah, and I, I speak to people who don't can't afford an AC, and I tell them work harder because you really should have. One. <laughs> but bread is also going. I mean, whole whole. But those who can't afford bread, decide. blame the government because that's like a limit, you know. No, but we AC are, we've been bit... defined by power, you know. The power, oh, they call. Careful, them. careful. From power, you're going to go to beverages. Stop there. <laughs> <laughs> no. 
I can see I can see the conversation slip into political uh, <laughs> refinement. Yeah. yeah. Okay, let me find a fun topic. So no, it, Italy, any... Italy oh. has apparently uh, is in a bid to ban uh, English from their all their official uh, business. What the fuck you saying? <laughs> No way. <laughs> That's an offer you can't refuse. I can't refuse. <laughs> yeah. uh, so, is... by, by the way, let me explain to you a few things. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Italy has a sort of right-wing government yeah, yeah, in power. Yeah, yeah. Just as Finland may have by the end of this week, Sweden has. So whenever we have right-wing, one of the great things is culture is in trouble. Mm, yeah. Right. And when you have culture, not that it happens in India because we are so. I mean, we would never say, <laughs> hey, Dev Nagari, me likho. You know, because Crips Dev sounds Dev correct. Nagari, Dev Nagari. Dev Nagari. <laughs> It's, not, a, it's hey. not a neighborhood. What do you said? <laughs> what do you said? I'm with you. I'm going with Nagri. Nagri. Tell him. Nagri. Oh. Tell me Shahrukh Khan's house. Nagri. 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 So just, just to put that in yeah. perspective, that because there's a right-wing government, all these things start, you know, getting more muscular. This whole, uh, uh, like, save our culture and save our thing and yeah. push foreigners out and other influences out. So I don't think we should worry too much. Yeah, going back, backward or going forward, that's yeah. a debate. Besides, we have only one Italian in India that we can ask. <laughs> <laughs> no comment about that. Giovanni. <laughs> <laughs> and so Giorgio Meloni is the is the president's prime minister, president's She's name, a female, head a woman. of state. She's yeah, a woman. Yeah. Giorgio is a male name. And, you want to try uh, this again? Brothers of Italy is the party that uh, that's in oh, power. Right brothers, now. huh? Yeah, brothers. Way, of, that's like straight off, like <laughs> knocked off on full fan base. Uh, Georgia yeah, Meloni is a very pretty, sort of pretty looking woman. I'm not that we should yeah. get sexist about this, yeah. but I always enjoy attractive politicians. I think that's very important. We Looking have. around Biden, not India, but uh, everywhere Biden, else. Biden, uh, Jinping, yeah. Putin, not, you know, they're strange looking people at the end of the day. Yeah, that's true. And then you have a one or two, like Jessica. Arden, no? wasn't that the New Zealand girl? Jacinda. Yeah. She's who's, not there anymore. Yeah, she's not there anymore. But no, but she was. I'm saying, so you had that, yeah. you know, and now you have her. Meloni yeah. is also quite nice. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, there yeah. was some poll recently that uh, overall the uh, heads of uh, women as heads of state has gone down over the last uh, 10 years. Men are voting again. <laughs> it's clear. <laughs> the pandemic men didn't vote, but now they're back. <laughs> yeah. Woman, no! <laughs> So the bill is still still has to go through the parliament, but uh, the bill is in English, by the way. So that's why it's taking long. Yeah, <laughs> chair. <laughs> what is this? Anybody uh, holding a position in the office, uh, public administration, has to have quote written and oral knowledge and mastery of the Italian language. Wow. So, like knowledge and written and oral knowledge, I get. Why do they have to mastery over that? Yeah, that's a very clear area. Eloquent. What is mastery? Yeah. You have to be eloquent. No, but you could, if you can ask the guy, you could just say you have no mastery by finding Googling two Italian words and nobody knows. So, in it, Italian, if you're speaking without the hand gesture, <laughs> yeah. you have to gesture, then you're master. No, a couple no, of words which are missing, like uh, just like in India, like corruption, mm. honesty. Huh. You, you, you just, you know, you just eliminate, words. eliminate all those. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 To quote an Italian poet. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, uh, let's do one more topic. Uh, huh. So, a couple in America. You like the way he sets up the stories? Yeah, yeah. See, we're let's professional here, Owen. Yeah. We're never going to get this Pause. experience again. Let's, let's An start. anchor who's just seeing the topic. Yeah. Uh, and and scrolling. Yeah, yeah. An old anchor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. An old anchor so old he needs an assistant anchor <laughs> <laughs> to talk to one guy who could have done the whole show on his own. You didn't need us. <laughs> I am merely here to bring you back whenever you digress from the talk. Oh. And it's needed. Yeah. <laughs> You're saying that? Have you heard yourself? Can you play the show back to him? Uh, a couple has been arrested in California for running, uh, for running a YouTube channel where they were essentially crashing cars. So wow. they would essentially show you how to crash a car so that you can claim insurance on the... Arre, I thought it was much worse. <laughs> I thought they made fun of Joe Biden or something. You know, isn't no. that like... Crashing cars. Yeah. yeah. But that's probably like a national pastime over there. No? Yeah. They, just... they have the space. Yeah, they ha- and they have these, these uh, massive little, uh, the, these things where they, they jump in the air. They and call the big truck and... semis. Yeah. That means there's something bigger coming. <laughs> yes, yeah. And they smash them. Oh, really? Wow. What fun to have land, no? That yeah. much. That's the main thing and, is they've got so much more space and, to drive. The Americans explain everything. To so we've insulted yes. Italians. Now we're going for Americans. I'm just putting well, in perspective. Okay. No, so he's saying good things about yeah. the Americans. Backstreet Boys are from where? America. They're not coming. <laughs> no, no, no. One is Italian-American. One he's thing not about coming. The Americans, yeah. they, they're, 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 they're the brave yes. country. Yeah. Yeah. Who's the brave country? America. I'm a big America fan. Yeah. yeah. If you don't mind. Yeah, they're a big, they're a brave country. Yeah. Forget the foreign policy. It's not always the best. But other than that, I'm. what's wrong with America? They have the best music. Burger King! For you. Burger we we also have Burger King. Yeah. Yeah. Elvis. I mean, he's Elvis, right. Elvis, that King Cole. Elvis. The mic at a museum. Actually, 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 the, the, the best music came out of, out of, out of UK. Yeah. The best music came out of the Beatles. Yeah, yeah. Fair enough. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. No, I just what about India? Tansen. 
Tansen. Huge no, man. Tansen. Huge. Today he's sold really a lot dead. of records. I want yeah. a statue. There's no statue of Tansen. No way. No statue. We should we should do this. Take yeah. out the Zubin Mehta statue. Can we do a poll right now? Where Zubin Mehta statue has been erected, they put Tansen immediately. Zubin Over has, it. Zubin has a. Well, or one Parsi is just not moving. Nariman point. That's what wow. Khada Parsi is. Stop it! <laughs> The holy month of Ramzan, I don't want this talk. <laughs> um, I was just googling, is there really no uh, uh, statue of Tan Sen? It's a live show. Uh, yeah, yeah. Apparently, <laughs> apparently, there's a monument. Ah, okay. there's a monument. Yeah. There's a monument. We're, we're going somewhere. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, tomb of Muhammad Ghaz and, uh, and Tan Sen. Anyway, we'll look into that uh, yeah. later. Yeah. Tomb, tomb, there will be none. Because no at the end, you all die. So, yeah. Where you sound? I need to say everything. like music. It's all except. I hate music. <laughs> But uh, one last topic, uh, speaking of Mohammad Duas and Tan Sen, uh, the NCRT has deleted a chapter about the Mughals from their textbooks, from the history textbooks. Why they didn't? Who's surprised? <laughs> well, which chapter may I know? Like what? Which part? Uh, I will tell you. <laughs> that guy's son, na, hmm. that question had come in the exam paper. Yeah. Oh. And he had failed. Failed it. So he said, "We'll remove the subject." Yeah. That's the man. If my only my mom did that with maths, <laughs> <laughs> there'd be no maths for you. Really? I'd be in the navy. Yeah. <laughs> from from class. Tw- <laughs> Yeah. From class 12, chapters related to kings and chronicles, the Mughal courts, 16th and 17th centuries, have been removed from the history book themed Indian History Part 2. Okay, but what's Which the means these coming? kings no, are not important, essentially. So from, the, the uh, from they must Babar, have not made anything. From Babar to, uh, to Aurangzeb, Zafar, basically. To, Zafar the Konja, Aurangzeb pay only there. So, so after Aurangzeb, okay, when the decline happens, you see. Yeah. The education decline, is there, no, yeah. Oh, decline I mean, is happening, uh, let's record that. Yeah. How, I mean, how do we come in? Because education is know the education. Yeah. We don't know. Yeah. No, no, no. You, history can history. be made fiction also. You can yeah. change it over the years. It gets boring. Yeah, yeah. The same guy wins all the time. Pani, but this guy, Pani, but this guy. Yeah. Let's change it. Pani, but that guy. You wow. know, and then it all goes. It's like football. Yeah, yeah, if yeah. Man U keeps losing, who's going to watch the EPL? No? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> also, a chapter called American But hegemony. the damn good at yeah, this. Yeah. <laughs> last few years, they're really yeah, yeah. perfecting really? it. Yeah. <laughs> Lose from any what position. What was the last one? Yeah. Seven. No, yeah, seven. seven. That's Liverpool, no, bro. Yeah. Seven. <laughs> <laughs> of course, that's the only time Liverpool won. That's another story. Yeah, yeah. They reserved everything for that one game. Game and get it right. Yeah. Risha, I have never seen Rishi so happy at any episode. How can you lose seven love when you're when you're one of the top seven, ever teams seven in the world? Is the problem. Yeah. Seven That's too much. Even seven. three, four would be embarrassing. But seven, seven, uh, and wow. seven is some other people's lucky number. There. Yeah, in India, seven. If they lost in India, they'd get felicitated yeah. in one statue. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, oh. let's go to the AMS because oh, uh, yeah, there was another chapter about American hegemony in in world politics that has been removed. Okay. Yeah. But that was the American ambassador because <laughs> the spellings all wrong. <laughs> Aniket Paul is saying alternate ending, just like Hazard Age. Well, oh, thank you, Aniket. He's just plugging my show for me, but I don't oh. want to go there. So uh, now that he's plugging it, please uh, listen to the show called Hazard Aged Well. Hazard Aged Well. Yeah, it's all huh. about you love cinema. Right? Yeah, I could have been on that show. <laughs> <laughs> well, very Hazard well. Aged Well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know, we change the show to Omen. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and the show ends because yeah. we found the guy who's aged well. End of the show. Yeah. That's how we discuss films which which have whether you, they have. You want to go to go on about it? <laughs> yeah, please. <laughs> He's pitching his own show every time. I mean, Owen's giving you a full ad here. You don't do anything more. Yeah. yeah. Uh, cool. Let's go to the AMS. The first question comes from Aniket, which is about football. Yeah. Uh, Owen, do you still support Man City? Your thoughts on the four-one thrashing of Liverpool uh, <laughs> uh, this season so far, and global top teams coming to India for matches, and how BMS can help organize them? You know, that's uh, that's something actually Aniket second that we're working first. on. So uh, second part first, yeah. so, something that we are actually working. Will really on. happen? Top the A team will come. You know, the the one. Because I know they'll send the C team and all that. No, so we are we're actually talking about doing, but to find the right time gap for them to in, come in, in the calendar you mean yeah for them calendar uh, usually when they are Live. available then that's when you know you, the, the 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 guys oh, so don't want to or they want to break but that yeah. June July period they normally will when we have the Euro ha. Cup or the World Cup yeah. so two years you're safe so there is there is some format which is happening in Thailand around that time so we hopefully oh, so we're they working. want to go for massages because no, they no, play no. 10 months a year so the back is broken yeah. legs are paining yeah of course yeah. Yeah. so yeah. just before they go for their massage now yeah. check now quickly yeah. check with the to work it out surveyor with and yes Man City still let's check the geography books if uh, Thailand can be part of India because in Ashok's empire it goes all the way down to okay. but they deleted the chapter deleted guys do everything in a hurry uh, okay, the next one comes from. Dave. I have a question. Dave. Yeah, go ahead. Uh, how many of Sanjay Dutt pictures have you watched? Uh, all the essential ones. <laughs> <laughs> Can you do any dialogues of Sanjay Dutt from the movies? No. 
Okay. I'll do that pacha sola pacha. Karan is saying AMA if Owen Ronkon went on has it as well will the film be Sanju? <laughs> what did you think of the film Sanju? Uh, uh it was an entertaining film but not very did, I didn't think it scratched the surface of his real life. Really? Yeah. Raju Hirani pull up your pant. No no he uh, Raju did a fab job as and as much as you can cram into that 1 yeah. hour 2 hour slot. Yeah. You know he did Oh so you're best. not being critical you're just saying that there's they couldn't really get into all yeah, there 2000 was, other stories. He that, should be a you know like Game of Thrones or a season. Yeah, it should be a mini series. <laughs> 17 uh, that's seasons. That's what seasons yeah. is. His <laughs> life should be honest. Who would play Owen? Huh? That's what the question Adam <laughs> Ahmed would be paid us two. Why you think I'm saying that Mr. Canadian dollars uh. and he's asked <laughs> Which actor played you in Sanju? Yeah, so he's paid two dollars. <laughs> no, 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 no. I thought we answered it right up to Abdul Khatri. Yeah. <laughs> but then we have to show Owen from early days also. Yeah. So then we, the hurdles we we'll have to then use a patla for Abdul to be pushed over. What's and a then patla? Where you stand, That's the short guy stands on the patla, oh, no? and then you yeah. go over it. <laughs> what? What did you not? Get I don't know. That's why I asked you. Abdul can speak Urdu fluently. Yeah, it's a very Urdu. The first word, word in the dictionary. <laughs> <laughs> but Abdul Khatri. Uh, I would mind. He's a good guy. Yeah, But I, I, I have that. I have that grumbling side we, of me. Yeah. We need, I like we need a bigger, athletic-looking guy. So I would go with John. John would be good. John is too big, bro. <laughs> he'll he'll cut down if the money is good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> cut down a little bit. Yeah. I'm going with John. No, no. I, I think uh, I think Khatri because I I like that vibe of standing in the corner and grumbling. That's my ambition. My my final aim in life is that we've got a nice house in Goa, and I keep telling Priya, my final last lap, I want to buy that white Ganji. Huh. I want to buy one. Shorts. Why don't do anything below? No, I want to buy those those, you, those checkered shorts. Hmm. Huh. I want to stand outside the gate. Huh. I want to scratch my stomach and grumble. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you going? Why are you in there? That's what I want my life. <laughs> This picture will start a political party. <laughs> This is all we need. You'll we'll be the leader of a new front. Grumble at random. Yeah. Where are you going? Lovely. Where are you going? You convince me. I'm I'm <laughs> following you. You come next house and you grumble. Bye the year. Okay, the next one comes from Grim Fandango. Grim asks, did Dan's internal situation lead to the close down of Fountainhead marketing? Uh no comment. <laughs> Who's Dan? <laughs> Who's Dan? <laughs> Dan uh I think Dentsu International is the one. Dan? Oh. I have no idea. Are you no, pretending Dan to be dumb? Is, or no, no. So founder <laughs> founder MKTG still exists. Yeah. With in Dentsu. Yeah. Uh So it's not close. So is Grim Fandango drunk? <laughs> Who's Dan? <laughs> I, th- I think he probably means someone from the Dead Zoo system. The yeah, guys okay. who bought Fountain Indian. Okay. Right. Maybe he means Dins. Uh, Fandango, please clarify. Yeah. You have five seconds. Please yeah. do. Uh, Shavik Bakhti has an interesting question. He says, Owen, have you ever checked for a movie ticket to see the availability of seats and the prices on BMS and then went to the theater and bought the ticket to avoid paying the convenience <laughs> charges? <laughs> Brilliant! That was brilliant, bro. That's brilliant. Uh, yes. No. <laughs> no. No. Look, uh, if it's convenient, you pay for it, yeah. Pay for the convenience. You already, uh, you already endorsed him. Now, what's huh. the point? Which which brings us to Samir's question. Very straightforward question. Why BMS charges so much fees for each ticket? And thoda to kamane de. My children have to go to school, yeah, bro. Thoda to kamane de. Percent percentage wise, what is the difference? Nothing, bro. It's like a. नहीं नहीं कहाँ दस तू तू फाइव परसेंट तू इस फॉर कन्वीनियंस वेरी लिटिल फाइव परसेंट सेवेन परसेंट तू बिकम फाइव सेवेन नो सर्टेन सर्टेन समटाइम्स टेन ब्रो यू रियली अ बिजनेसमैन तू इस बाबू कम टेन वाइ इन वन सेंटेंस नहीं नहीं डिपेंड्स ऑन सुनी सुनी आई एम पिंग डबल देस सो मच इस गाइस इट्स अनबिलीवेबल No, 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 no. You're really Atul Khatri. Different, different. You're Atul Khatri. You're not Owen. <laughs> Khatri has come. <laughs> Khatri uh, is going to walk into this yeah, office yeah, any yeah. moment. Yeah. <laughs> He's even jogging. What are you doing? Switch, switch. Uh, Karan has a question. He says, Owen, what are your thoughts on the Ticketmaster trial going on in the US, and what is what is your response to some of the complaints people have with the concerts today? So uh, uh didn't expect you, these questions yeah. abita <laughs> come on trial this is a trial show you Thank come you here you face yeah. the court <laughs> no the the well th- that's going to be a long run out one that whole well played thing. well played but um, <laughs> i think there's there's much that we need to do for our concerts over here uh we we are we are the primary problem is that we're dealing with make sure make sure venues there is yeah, no venue exactly. purpose yeah. i mean there's no purpose built venues yeah. we don't have a single venue which is like built nothing. for rock Um, for nothing, music nothing, or whatever nothing 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 what about like so, there's nothing there's just i mean there was rang bhavan but now it's shut yeah but even rang bhavan won't it was actually it's not valid nattics. today it was not it's not for yeah. concerts per yeah. se yeah. and yeah. also you know so i mean you have to start with the parking exactly. yeah. yeah so i mean rang bhavan again is a non starter yeah. yeah. there's nothing yeah. then uh, where to find girls 
where were uh, to uh, find uh, always walking five guys in one minute so embarrassing yaar <laughs> when will that end really <laughs> So, when we make a nice secure safe and you don't do that business right? <laughs> <laughs> but how do you work around that then do you uh, look at like like for all up rosa you had the entire race course yeah uh, book so, yeah that, that but that's yeah. make shift again you know so so therefore we uh, the the effort right now in book my show is also to create environments where we can <laughs> anushka you, anushka dy D- patel and mankhade Anu- anushka has a comment that's why neeta ambani made the cultural center that's why <laughs> and but precisely yeah she's responded good, to the good call friend. you're a good friend uh Sure. Speed dial. <laughs> <laughs> you you think he'd be on our podcast no, if he no, had no. Nitam Bani on speed dial? <laughs> no, but you but it's a fabulous player. What is very well connected. I mean that 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 center that she's made is, is unbelievable. Hmm. That that even that auditorium and all series have Reliance bought book my show. No no no. Oh, you're just saying it actually. Yeah no no actually okay. actually uh, it's unreal that hmm. that uh, auditorium is. Massive. So why didn't you build something then, you guys, or, or in partnership with someone? We are we're actually think uh, talking about venues right now. There is a lot. Can you give us a hint business. where? Because I can't see in Mumbai any geography yeah. for this. Yeah, the problem in Mumbai is obviously yeah, really. See, so please don't say go to Nala Supara to build it. No, no, no. And then Mumbai is still really. <laughs> yeah, so, so give me give me an area. Where's the limit you would go to? No, but once you go to the outskirts, then there is a sort of you know you'll yeah, find yeah. Navi Mumbai. You'll find yeah. something. You know, so you know then they don't do, lose it. White elephant after white elephant. Yeah, yeah. Oh. but sorry, you know, to do oh. things that at DY and all, you know, you the concert has to be really compelling. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, to to get you, yeah, you know, exactly. get up your and really go there. Yeah. So it's it works both ways. You know? Yeah. But trying to address the situation, let's see how best we can. Yeah. Have you spoke to uh, spoken to our leaders, mm-hmm. management? Huh? They can help you with venues. Yeah, we also do that. Uh, we basically sell land. Yeah, <laughs> best part is we sell land we don't own, <laughs> which is in India is considered a great scheme. <laughs> uh, Ayush is in the chat. He's saying, "Can you bring Tame Impala to India?" <laughs> tried, <laughs> we tried Ayush, but but yes, we are working on that. Ayush yeah. is one of our and the killers. Yes, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. She's. We, why are you saying absolutely like you care? No, no. I saw the and okay. the killers. She said. Oh, okay. You getting the killers? Oh, yeah. I would like. So we're we're. So you're just saying yes, I own. No, no, no. You're like a fucking. <laughs> you don't even know. You don't even know Nita Ambani, and now you're just like, I'll get anyone. You'll bring the dead I'm, Beatles together. I'm you saying, know what I mean? There's no end to it. I'm saying, wait. These are these are definitely on our list. Yeah. In fact, the uh, last Lola, Lola, we were talking to Tame, and we were talking to the Ooh. killers, and yeah, yeah. So Lola was, was your thingy. Of, yeah. Oh. Yeah. How much of input do you have about for the lineup? Can I just say something? Huh. I got really irritated with Lola. Why? Because I had a pop. My car could move for fifty twenty minutes on one Saturday night. You know, I, mean, I was like, hey, "What the hell?" Now he's. Gonna, now I was he, thinking he was now like, the other side. Then I saw these, these drunkards coming off. You remember from, when you you caused all these fifty yeah, twenty yeah. minutes? But now I'm an old man. Now I'm Atul Khatri. You know, I'm, things have changed. For God's sake. Yeah. Yeah. Atul, Atul is going to walk in and beat us. He loves us. <laughs> you have a very nice equation. Yeah. He he knows we're stupid. He's a sweet guy. You like Atul, no? Huh? I love Atul. Why has he been on our show? He's been on the show, sir. So watch him out. He's here today. <laughs> I'm going. Uh, he's, can he's, I throw a name in uh, from my huh? head? Uh, Please, Paul Jam. Please. <laughs> Why you? It's not sex, yeah. No. But no. What, what is that sound? But Pearl Jam and Foo Fighters are like dream. He's like Kunal with real jam. What the hell is that? No, no. So so here's here's the. I mean. Uh. We have a See, lot of. We ever already promised it. Keep no, no, that link. No, <laughs> you already told Ayushi you're getting killers down, and I knew. No, I did not say Ayushi. Yeah. I did not say that. Uh-huh. Ayushi, I I definitely said that. So, you, let's just understand how these mechanics work. Okay. <laughs> no, no, I'm Welcome going. to the business head. It's, yeah, I, like, it's, oh, yeah, it's, yeah. it's 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 sweet enough to be able to get Pearl Jam on bed yeah. when yeah. they have availability. Right. It's very tough to get Pearl Jam on the days that you want. Okay. You get sir. So also there's. So you're talking to thirty, forty bands. Right. In order to get thirty, forty bands aligned on two days, you need to talk to five hundred bands. Hmm. Uh, then you need to fit them into a budget, hmm. because if we have to get all like you know, last time even when we announced the lineup, there was a lot of chatter. Yeah. Quite honestly, there was a lot of effort to bring in those bands. Hmm. Uh, it was the first Lola, hmm. and we were being compared to the you know first Lola in India. Yeah. We were being compared to the you know twentieth edition that has happened yeah. in other places. Yeah. and you know so comparisons are good expectation is very high i think we did pull off a great festival at yeah, the yeah. fit that was the um where we are definitely pushing for better line some lineups better artists bigger artists hopefully ho jayega i have a song ha huh? sing pella lola <laughs> Because that's says, it. <laughs> I'm to work on the lyrics. <laughs> Lola, that, 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 so that was the chorus. Lola, only only Tola are rhymes with it. I don't want to go there no, and no, bring back no, your no, brother-in-law. No, 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 no. Yeah. So, so that was the chorus. That Bella? was it. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Your budget gave Lola, you this. Much. Lola, Falooda, <laughs> and the song's over. 
<laughs> oh, we had some great times with the name though. Yeah. yeah. Every time we had to apply for the permission and went into. But nobody stumbled on the name. Uh, oh, it's me. Lola ka hai. Their versions of it was mad. Yeah. yeah. Beautiful. It was beautiful. You know. But well, you're safe. You can't really copy it. I don't think. Yeah. <laughs> it's a real pain in the ass. Who wants to copy that? Yes. I mean, many times you go like, you can't just call it like. Good. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's good. I love it. I mean, it was it was good. Good happy vibe. Are you? She's asking for Fred again now. Fred? Uh, they think you're like a Zomato. <laughs> just calling everything. Mujhe ye chahiye. Bas that's it. Yeah. yeah. So uh, can you get Fred again? Man, you must be getting a lot of this now. When I think yeah, about yeah, it, yeah. who's the, Fred? The guys who don't know you well enough but know you. Yeah. They are the ones who go on irritating you, right? Yeah. I mean, you walk into the gym or something hey, like that. Yeah. Bro, 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 bro. Dash face, bro, bro. And Tomorrow. Then, <laughs> and then and then get and then send me free tickets. Huh? Yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Come on. Now everybody's putting their recommendation. Get the yeah. weekend. Yeah. Oh, yeah. weekend is mad, yeah. yeah. And BTS. And Whoa. BTS. You have to sell. Okay, oh, yeah, we have to wrap up. What's that Korean band called? Yeah, BTS. BTS. Massive, the huge, Oof. yeah, and huge is an answer. Can I be honest? Couldn't bear it. <laughs> Until they sang "Hey Jude" in one talk show, I was quite. Surprised. <laughs> so, yeah, to, in English, yeah. BTS, uh, we'll have to have one band at the festival. <laughs> really? Yeah. Yeah. What expensive? What Indian band uh, would you promote? You like know, Indian Ocean, all those guys that we had growing so up. So we had, we had a shit ton of uh, uh, yeah. Indian Rock, Indian yeah. artists on, yeah. on the bill, and we still have, we will still have at least fifty percent Indian artists on the bill. Do they get good? Uh, Rap you know, on the crowd. You know, what I was, what I was amazed at, and uh, so the same, the same crowd who was, you know, kicking at, at with uh, Imagine Dragons, yeah. was loving, and you know, people like Divine and stuff, mm. uh, who performed, it, I, Divine completely Huge. killed it, yeah, killed yeah, yeah. it. Divine's been on the show, huh, by the way, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. This, him, you remember? This, Khatri, you don't. You know, this audience, this uh, audience has never really seen Divine. Why, like. why this? Uh, this Very important why not question. Uh, Shavik Bakhti, need why not Pankaj Udas? Maybe man, not Lala his, his wife is Parsi, <laughs> so if, I would take it as a religious issue if you didn't. Uh... Pankaj Udas is uh, we, we, when we, we're going to do a format where we also do the early morning and. Uh, you think uh, there could be a group of people who actually listen to classical Indian, Western, and rock, rap, electro? Is there someone like that who listens? Sure, to yeah. There might be a market. You never know. But, but that's what Lola Palooza was. Yeah. No, but Lola has his limit. Now there's no Pankaj Udas, for example. Yeah. <laughs> Pankaj, he might not want to play at Lola. Yeah. But would yeah. he get a response from those kind of people? Those uh, hard uh, we, weed smoking. To, you know, so uh, we have to uh, slot in with the right energy of the moment. You're very diplomatic. You should have been in politics. <laughs> Call your wife right now. Let me have a word. Really. 2024 is around the corner. Uh, which party do you want to support? Have you okay. heard of the one with the lotus? Huh? No? Okay. We have to wrap up, sir. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Good time now. It's a good time now. I'm pretty We're close. Slipping. I'm close to Sharad Pawar. I can put in a quickly, good word. Quickly, quickly wrap up. Hey, it's nice. You know. Have you heard of the Shiv Sena? Thank you. Thank many you, for hey, thank you. you can start your own Shiv Sena and i've got great news for everybody yes it is the end of the show people are clapping and cheering because now it's over the pain the angst the suffering the strife but remember it's very simple like and subscribe everybody says the same thing we've repeated as well because there's a whole uh, uh, we have to follow this process it's not in my hands honestly i don't want to do this sometimes but we have to follow it so please like and subscribe and yeah you can leave your comments and please spell correctly because it's very irritating when you spell color with a k for god's sake or coca cola with a p i mean oh that's pepsi sorry <laughs>